get six, there goes two out of this mix. Subtract two from six, you'll get four, there goes two, and not any more. Subtract two from four, you'll get two, there goes two, leaving very few. Subtract two from two, you'll get zero, here is one and two, away they go. Zero zilch not. Subtraction Good morning children. You are second monthly test is over and you studied well chapter 2 addition. Then continue chapter 3 subtraction. Today we are going to study subtract by counting backward. Subtract by counting backward. Listen. Can you count backward from 1 to 10? Let us start. 10. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. So you all know to count the backward. Okay. Today we are going to study subtract by counting backward. Okay. You study addition by counting forward. You have study addition by counting forward. Isn't it? We are going to study subtraction by counting backward. Counting backward. Okay. Let us start. How we subtract by counting backward. I have to subtract 9 minus 3. How can I subtract by counting backward? First of all, we have the bigger number 9. Take the bigger number 9 in your mind and take the smaller number 3 on your finger. Take the smaller number 3 on your finger. All of you take 3 on your finger. 1, 2, 3. Okay. Then we are going to count backward from the bigger number. Okay. The bigger number is 9. So 9 in your mind. The number before 9. What comes before 9? 9 before Number before 9 is 8, 7, 6. Got it. Count backward from 9. You count backward 3 steps. To subtract 9 minus 3, you count backward from 9. 9 before 8. Then 8 before 7. 7 before 6. So you have got the difference is 6. You see? Then one more question. 7 minus 2. How can you subtract 7 minus 2 using fingers? Which is the bigger number? It is 7. So 7 keep in your mind and take the smaller number on your finger. The smaller number is 2. Take 2 on your finger. Then count backward from 7. The number before 7 is 6. Then 5. So the difference is 5. One more question. All of you do together. The question is 10 minus 6. Which is the bigger number? It is 10. Keep in your mind 10 and take smaller number on your finger. Which is the smaller number is 6. Smaller number is 6. You count and take 6 on your finger. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay. Then count backward from 10. The number before 10 is 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. So the difference is 4. Yes. Did you all understand? Then take your notebook and write the heading. Take 10 on your finger. Then count backward. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Question is. Do yourself. Okay. 9 in your mind. 
Two on a finger. Number before nine. Number before nine. Count backward. Next. Ten minus five. Okay. Next. Seven minus four. Next. Eight minus six. Do yourself. And also you can do your textbook page number 55. Page number 55. And in your textbook it is given like this. Look at this. 9 minus 3. The bigger number is 9 and smaller number is 3. Okay. They already have put 3 dash. Okay. This is for writing the numbers backward from 9. So, 9 before, the number before 9 is 8, 8 before 7, 7 before 6. Okay. We have subtracted 3 from 9. So, we are writing the number backward from 9. 9 before 8, 7, 6. Then, your difference is 6. Difference is 6. Okay. Then you can do your textbook page number 55. Then we move on to the next. The next topic is subtracting 0. Subtracting 0. Subtracting 0. Subtract 0 from a number. Is it easy? See? Okay. I have two sketches. I am taking away 0 from it. How many are left? How many are left? Tell me. 2 are left. That means did I take any number from it? No. 0 means nothing. So when we subtract 0 from any number, we get the same number. So very easy. Take your notebook and write subtract 0. That means the first example is 2 minus 0. I have two crayon sketches. I have two sketches. I am taking away zero from it. How many are left? Two are left. So the answer is two. When we subtract zero from any number, we get the same number. Okay. Then some more examples for you. Nine minus zero. What is nine minus zero? Nine. Take a notebook and copy down this. Then 8 minus 0. What does it? 8. 7 minus 0. What does it? Say number 7. So you can conclude any number. Any number minus 0 equal to same number. The number itself. Sure, you can write same number. Okay. All of you study subtraction very well. Understood? Then you can do your textbook page number 56. Page number 56. And next we move on to the next two topic is subtract a number from itself. Subtract a number from itself. Okay. See the next two topic is Subtract a number from itself. That means at this, I have two sketches. I'm going to give this two to my best friend. First I gave this yellow one. Then I gave this purple color also. Then how many left with me? Zero. That means if we subtract a number from itself, we get the difference is zero. The answer in subtraction is called the difference. Okay. So, 2 minus 2 is equal to 0. 2 minus 2 is equal to 0. We subtract a number from itself. We get the difference is 0. Got it. You have 5 chocolate. You give away the 5 to your mother. How many left with you then? Okay, you have five chocolate. First you give the first one. Then second one. Third one. Fourth one. Fifth one. 
How many left with you then? Zero. That means 5 minus 5 is equal to 0. The next 6 minus 6. You have 6 crayons. You give away the 6 crayons to your best friend. Then how many left with you? 0. 6 minus 6 is 0. Got it? Then you can do, yeah, copy down this to your notebook and also you can do your textbook page number 56. Okay? Then we move on to the next topic is subtraction facts. In subtraction facts, it's already given in your textbook. You have to fill up this answers. Okay. Page number 57. Page number 57, 58 and 59. Then today's class is over. Thank you. Subtracting 0. We know that 0 means no object. So, when 0 is taken away from any number, the difference is the number itself. For example, from a bunch of 7 flowers, if we take away 0 flowers, there will still be 7 flowers in the bunch. As 7 minus 0 is equal to 7. Similarly, if 0 boxes are taken away from 9 boxes, then the number of boxes remaining will be 9 minus 0 is equal to 9 boxes. Subtraction resulting in 0. When we subtract a number from the same number, the result is 0. For example, if we take out all 6 fish from this fish bowl, the number of remaining fish in the fish bowl will be 6 minus 6 is equal to 0.